Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. In this tutorial, let us go through data mining. So basically the word data mining. So like coal mining or gold mining, we are saying data mining. So we are searching for something, right? So the thing is that you will be searching for something and you will be converting this thing into some patterns or graphs and you will be gaining knowledge. So this is the concept of data mining. So it is the process of discovering or mining knowledge from a large amount of data. Data mining is also known as discovery of data. Fine. So this attempts to extract hidden patterns and trends from large databases. So if there is a large database, we can get the data in this way. And also we can also have the automatic exploration of data. Fine. So this is a small diagram guys. So initially we are having the database. This databases can be at different different locations. After that we converted it to warehouse. So we have selected a particular database. And in that we searched for a particular volume of data. That is nothing but data mining. So we got this volume. So we converted that volume into some patterns like uh, graphs or some patterns and we converted those patterns to particular knowledge. So this is the concept of data mining. So what is the need of data mining? So finding hidden information from the database, we'll be using this data mining. So extracting meaningful information, we, it can be done by using this data mining. So now let us go through the steps which we have followed now. Let us go through one one line introduction. So database, database is nothing but large amount of data is stored here. At different locations, the situation might be. And after that, we are having data warehouse. So large amount of data is stored in this data warehouse. Whereas data mining, data mining is nothing but we will be discovering the data from it and we will be converting the data into certain patterns and gaining knowledge. So that is nothing but data mining. So I hope everyone got a clear idea. So now let us continue with the goals. So the first goal of it is to optimize, to optimize usage of resources to the less limit and for identifying the patterns and to have the behavior about the attributes. So now I hope everyone got a small idea on this. So in the next tutorial, we'll be going to start the SQL commands and SQL guys. Thank you. Thanks for watching.